Hello guys, Wuhu here, back with another video, this time around guiding you through uh, Turkey Tobia 2018. And uh, as you can see right on the screen, it is going on from the 20th of November, uh, the day that I'm recording it. Also, it's going all the way to December 3rd, so you have plenty of time to do this. Uh, I did all this, of course, in, in a couple of hours or something like that, but you can do it like way faster but you can also just take your time and i suggest you do that because uh, there's not really anything to gain from it but there is uh, a few nice things like bound brilliance and some dragonite and also actually just the first one gives you 25 dragon coins so that's definitely worth at least doing the first one and of course i will go over each and every single step uh, one at a time so we can keep up with it you can also go to the description you can just see a quick little guide there i made uh, each step really quickly but if this guide was uh, nice for you or you liked it make sure you like it and maybe subscribe helps me out very much and also kind of spreads it around to people and they can also benefit from watching this guide so with it, without further ado let's jump into step all right so step one is to the defeat 30 of these uh, turkeys here they are basically all over the place in the dragon fire peaks and it doesn't have to be uh, u5 as i'm doing it right here it can be any uh, biome that is the dragon fire peak so it's not any biome but it's any difficulty that is that has dragon fire peaks <laughs> so you just find them on the surface as you can see i'm doing right here uh, it doesn't take very long to get these 30 um and they can also be big bosses and stuff like that you will not find them in dungeons though so you do have to only find them on the uh, surface uh these also drop the turkey uh small turkey boxes that has special turkey uh themed loot in it like uh the mount and the ally and such and so on and so on but that is uh, basically step one so let's head on to step two all right so step two is to go to any difficulty just you gotta be in the kandoria biome and you have to find a dungeon that has this uh, cupcake boss uh it's it's only one stars so you just go to one and defeat that and you are basically set for step two and you can head on to step three all right so step three is to mine 100 primordial flames and I feel like there is most in the dragon fire peaks but they're uncommonly all over in any biome and whatnot that's why i said in the beginning don't just take your time with doing this and farm them up you do get extra on tuesday so that might be a thing if you just want to wait for tuesday and just mine those uh, like you can see here right here i am not having too many and i actually think i did this in like a couple of minutes actually I'm not sure if you can get them off the marketplace or not, but that could also be an option if you were interested. You could probably like buy one, see if that works, and then if you just want to do that. But it doesn't take very long, like a couple of minutes to just get these if you go to the Dragonfire Peaks. Or you can go in any biome and just find them randomly and you will be done with step three. So let's head to step four. So step four is pretty simple. You just have to loot collect uh, anything that gives you blank scrolls. So like uh, recipes or block recipes or something like that. If you have some lying around, you can just use those or buy some off the marketplace and loot collect them. Maybe you can also just buy the blank scroll off the marketplace. I'm not sure, but it's very easy, simple step. So there's not really more to it than that. So let's jump on to step five. All right, so step five is to collect three Fey Dust. And you do, of course, this in the Fey area uh, biome. And uh, you just have to defeat uh, dungeons or enemies on the surface. Anything that you can defeat in the biome is going to have a chance to drop you some Fey Dust. And you're only going to get three. I uh, only need to get three. Uh, so it's took me like two and a half minutes or something like that to getting these and it's all random sometimes you're gonna get it faster sometimes you're gonna get it you know a little bit uh, longer than that uh, i'm not sure if you can get it off the marketplace or not uh, maybe people can comment below also with the previous steps if there was uh, if you're actually able to get it off the marketplace and if people want to kind of skip ahead a little bit quicker uh, with the different steps and whatnot but it's all random like i said it took me a little bit longer than i actually thought 
uh, but you only need to collect three Fey Dust. It doesn't gonna take you very long, so I suggest you just like do it when you are randomly doing dungeons or whatnot. So that was a little bit more of a rant on step five, so let's jump to step six. All right, so step six is to go to Bomber Royale and throw 20 bombs. Uh, you don't have to win, you don't have to do anything, you just have to throw 20 bombs. You can actually just start, be in the beginning and, and just throw them there. It's not like the bombs has to hit people or anything like that. It's just basically throwing the bombs whenever you have energy and you can just do that. Uh, I do suggest that you do participate, kind of, because there is a chance. Uh, I'm not going to show you the whole thing I did, but I actually uh, actually managed to get top uh, six. I got the sixth place. So I actually got a, a, you know, a, a PvP coin out of it, actually just randomly and that's always nice to get a random pvp coin uh so you just gotta throw 20 and as you can see i'm just kind of just running around not really uh going crazy or trying to to win it so just gotta throw 20 bombs and you're out of there and that's basically step six so let's get on to step seven all right so step seven is to defeat cannoneers and sailors around the uh, treasure islands they are a little bit harder to get i suggest if you find the big dungeon with the lighthouse on it i think that has a lot of these guys around so if you see that one definitely go for it but you just gotta go uh, to the treasure island biome and you know that's the one with the little uh, steering wheel on it so just go there find some dungeons i also found that these these small lighthouses actually have a good amount of these guys in there as well it's a little bit more of a tricky uh step maybe maybe the hardest step of all of these so uh like i said it took me a couple of hours also recording then some of this so yeah it's probably going to take you way less as you know you're not recording the footage as i am basically so more or less very easier step than most but still a little bit tricky to find these specific ones because they're not too common uh, unless you find like the right dungeons and stuff like that like i said a good idea is to find the lighthouse the big three star lighthouse dungeon that is that's a little bit uh, easier to 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 do all of these uh, cannoneers and sailors but that was uh, step seven let's head on to step eight All right, so step eight is to go to the desert frontier biome. And you can, of course, do this in any difficulty. You just have to find a one-star dungeon or maybe even a three-star dungeon uh, where it says that you have to defeat a saloon bot mayor. And this is how he looks. It's like the square brown guy there. And you just defeat that and you are basically done with step eight. And if you actually like this little guide, make sure, you, of course, again, you like it and subscribe, all that jazz. But uh, it was a fun little, uh, you know, uh, event. Uh, not taking very long, but you do get some awesome stuff in it. And I like these small ones. I wish there was more of them, but it does also have to make sense, you know, in the end that you are actually having these events. But like I said, it was some great, great uh, rewards with the actually the bound brilliance the luxurious boxes and also the meta matter always welcome reward for anything in trove but that was it i'll see you guys soon bye